Hey everyone, Gun Turbo here. So, not too long ago, this uh, patch came out. It's the unofficial Vivid Weathers and True Storms compatibility patch is basically what it is. And uh, I'm very excited about this and have been testing it out. Um, it seems to be working just fine. Basically what it does is it allows True Storms and Vivid Weathers to work harmoniously together to give you a overhaul to your weather system that is just, in my opinion, incredible. Um, if you've seen any of my other videos, you know that I use Vivid Weathers. I love Vivid Weathers, not only for the weathers themselves and the variety, but also the, uh, the lighting aspect that it brings to the game. And I had always, I had always liked True Storms because of how it improves the intensity of storms, the variation, um, some of the textures of rain and snow and things like that. But uh, they weren't always necessarily compatible. So this patch um, allows a number of things to happen. So in the load order, you're going to want True Storms first, followed by Vivid Weathers, and then the patch. And the description talks a little bit about what uh, this does. Um, it combines the thunder sounds for one thing. Um, it allows the audio sliders to work, which I'll show you guys something in a minute about that. Um, improves the particles for both uh, weather systems or uses both for both weather systems. Um, True Storms adds unique changes to, to uh, different regions. Um, interior sounds, and oh, the one that uh, really bothered me about Vivid Weathers is when it was snowing in the southern parts of Skyrim, you would hear a rain sound. And that was kind of crazy. And uh, also it seems to adjust the darkness setting in the Vivid Weathers book to work a little bit more properly, which is great. So uh, here we go. We are raining in the rift right outside Riften. And you'll hear some, some thunder sounds and uh, it's been working really well. Haven't, any prob haven't had any problems with it at all. The only weird thing I notice is that in settings, under audio, it puts both True Storms and Vivid Weathers sliders in the menu and only the vivid weather sound seems to work I think because it's probably overriding true storm so um, in this case you're gonna want to use these three here these three don't seem to be working for true storms I think it's just an overriding uh, factor although the mod description does say that they should the slider should work together but I don't know the sounds are there um, Everything else seems to be working fine, so it's great. Anyway, so I highly recommend this mod uh, to add to the load order uh, because I think True Storms is an excellent mod to have, and now that it will work with Vivid Weathers, then uh, in my opinion, it's a surefire combo. All right, thanks a lot.